This video is to help you diagnose issues with no sound in your computer. Uh, first thing you want to do is check the back of your computer and see if uh, you've got an onboard sound card or if you have a uh, sound actual sound card in it. If you have a sound card, you're going to see uh, basically ports kind of like these here, uh, but in one of these little kind of horizontal slots on your computer. If you see them like this here, this means you've got onboard. Uh, see, it's all kind of clustered together. Uh, this is an onboard sound card. And what you want to do is make sure you've got it plugged into the right port. Uh, this is probably the most common issue. And I've got on manual focus so you can kind of see the icons here. Uh, most of the time, uh, if you have just two speakers, you're going to plug in here. Uh, if you have a microphone, of course, it goes into the pink one with the microphone on it. But if you got like uh, three channels, you got the bass, and then you have an extra set of rear speakers uh, and additional channels here, all that. Um, but make sure you got everything plugged up in the right spot. Uh, green is for front speakers usually. Uh, orange, I want to say, is for rear. Uh, black is bass and uh, the other two I forget exactly what those are for um, I'll probably remember when I don't want to but uh, check your actual speaker documentation as well because the cables that match up with those uh, could be different as well but make sure you got your stuff plugged in okay if you got that plugged in check your speakers okay are your speakers actually on uh, it should be a given, but you know, make sure they're on. Make sure your volume is up. Uh, make sure the speakers are good. You know, go through, plug like a uh, iPod into that, or plug it into an iPod. See if anything comes out of them, um, or try some headphones in that green jack there. You should get something out of it if you go through and play some audio. Um, if you go through and you no longer have a speaker icon down at the bottom right corner. Uh, go ahead and open up your device manager. You can do that by uh, clicking on your start button and then right clicking on uh, my computer and then going to manage. Uh, that's going to bring up computer management and you want to click on device manager and over here uh, if you see some stuff like what we got here uh, see how we got audio device on high definition bus and several other little things here in Ethernet um, the chipset driver and video card those aren't installed so you need to go through and install your uh, audio drivers uh, you can download them off uh, either your computer manufacturers website or if you have an add-in card uh, go to the manufacturers website for that and download it there uh, so if you go through and you install that and you uh, don't see uh, the icon there uh, you can go into control panel and uh, basically make the speaker icon show up but if you don't see uh, sometimes it says something like audio device or sometimes I even see it come up as PCI device unknown PCI device um, go through and check under sound audio game controllers you should see something here this is like a real tech or uh, Creative Labs, uh, even uh, Turtle Beach. Uh, you'll sometimes see it under here. Uh, very rarely you'll see Turtle Beach one. But uh, use your real tech or Creative Labs. You'll see that under here. Or Enforce Audio. So if you see that there, you've got uh, sound card drivers installed. Uh, if you don't, check under unknown devices or other devices. Uh, another possibility is check your system BIOS. I'm not going to try and show it to you here in the video because each one is going to be different. But go into your BIOS. You can do that with either pressing F2 or uh, Delete or F1. There's a video I have on checking getting into your BIOS. But uh, go in there and check to see if your sound card is disabled. Because uh, if you have an onboard and your sound card is disabled, that's a reason for it not to show up in your system at all. Windows won't even recognize that it exists. Uh, so that's the 
uh, basically the quick way you can go through and diagnose a no sound issue on your computer. Uh, make sure your cables are plugged in. I love auto brightness adjustment. Make sure your speakers are on. And then make sure you actually have your drivers installed. And when all else fails at that point, um, do try the idiot thing of making sure you didn't mute uh, in Windows. Your sound icon will be down here. Or, like I said, go under Start, Control Panel, and then you have Sounds, uh, Speech, and Audio Devices. Uh, I think Windows 7 has something different like Audio Devices or something like that and go in there and if you see no audio device that means you don't have drivers installed or your device is disabled and make sure that mute and place icon on the taskbar uh, place icon should be checked but mute should not be checked and you want to make sure your volume is actually up so that's it I hope you enjoyed this little short video and if you got any questions feel free to post them below and until next time, I'll see you later.